Warning, feminist rant, feminist rant coming your way. Here it goes. Okay, so I have this lovely girl on my Facebook who I love so much. She's so feminist. She's such a lovely soul. Taught me a lot about meditation, all that goodness, spiritual guru, all that great mom. Well, today is her birthday. And unfortunately, she had a cry on her birthday. Do you know why? Because some privileged fuck who thinks that they're the body police of everybody thought that they needed to make snide comments about how young mothers shouldn't be wearing bikini and should be hygienic enough to shave. One, whoa, whoa, let's just stop right here. Let's stop. One, shaving has nothing to do with hygiene, you stupid fuck. As a matter of fact, if you shave too much or too often, you will get razor bumps and rashes. And I don't think that's very hygienic. Yes, your armpit hair has nothing to do with the smell. Yes, you can have armpit hair and still wash and still use deodorant. All right, that's disclaiming that one stupid fact. And another one, young moms wearing bikinis. Everybody's allowed to wear a bikini. Men can wear bikinis. I have some gay friends who look fabulous in bikinis. And what the fuck does being a mom have to do with a bikini? A bikini is a bathing suit. Oh, I'm a mom. I'm not supposed to swim anywhere. What is she supposed to do? Go to the 50s to get a motherfucking th swimming suit? I'm done. I'm done with y'all privileged motherfuckers and your standards of beauty. I'm okay, baby. I'm okay, baby. I'm just making a video. I'm so over it. Some days I wear weave, some days I don't. Some days I wear makeup, some days I don't. Sometimes I shave. Not right now. I'm not. Guess what? I'm not going to shave for another week. You know why? Because I don't want fucking razor bumps. I'm not going to get razor bumps because you want to look at my fucking armpits because of your preferences. I don't give a fuck what your preferences are. Are you licking my pussy at night? Am I sitting on your face? No. I don't give a shit about your preferences. I just think it's a little bit bullshit how, like, this is going to get longer in about two days. But it's not going to be super long. It's not going to be so hairy. It's going to be slightly longer. Like, long enough to where if I shave it, I'm going to be in so much pain. I'm going to itch. I'm going to turn red. It's gonna hurt. It's gonna sting to put deodorant on. But I know some of you fuckers, you're pulling my weave, baby. I know some of you fuckers would want me to and will make comments and point because of the little bit of darker hair. Well, obviously it's gonna show up. It's darker than my fucking skin. But again, who is my armpit hair hurting? Who is it hurting? Is it making the kids in China starve? No, I didn't think so. Is it making your mortgage go up? No, I didn't think so. Furthermore, furthermore, have you guys seen my armpits, my husband's armpit hair? It's long. Like, you could take a fucking weed whacker to it. Like, I know one damn razor would not take it all off. But you know what I think is interesting? Nobody says shit to this motherfucker about his armpits. He works out. long. He works out, you know, with the shirts that show your armpits. Meanwhile, me, because I don't want motherfuckers pointing at me and distracting me from my workout, I gotta cover up from hair that is barely longer than this. Because I don't want people pointing at me and strangers and making me feel bad. Like, it's okay for you... To like shaved armpits. It is not okay for you to tell anybody to shave their armpits. It is not okay for you to make somebody feel bad for not shaving. For with that, if you do these things, I hope you shave your own throat in front of the camera so I can watch. Because we need less people like you. We need less mentalities like you. We need less thoughts like yours. Wake up, it's 2016! Women are not objects. We can wear what we want. We can shave what we want. But, like, like women and men are, like, the same thing virtually now. Have you guys not realized that? With all this enlightenment going on, and you still worried about a bitch's armpit? I don't get it. It's frustrating. It has been frustrating. Ever since the sixth grade, when I started puberty, and my mom was like, I don't want you shaving too early. It'll hurt you. And a bunch of little white privileged kids are like, yeah, yeah, you're dirty, you're hairy. Well, that's because I have titties and you don't. Ugh. I hate it. If you, for a second, if you as a person think, like, well, I hate unshaved. I think it's gross. Educate yourself. First, I want you to ask yourself where that thought comes from and why you hate it so much that it disgusts you. That it literally makes you see a person who is not shaved as less valuable. I want you to look in the mirror and I want you to know and figure out where that disgusting thought and place comes from. And then I want you to educate yourself about body hair. Mm-hmm. And then I want you to shut the fuck up about all your opinions. Because male or female, grooming is a choice. Shaving is a choice. Just like male having a beard or not having a beard is a choice for a female. Shaving my legs, shaving my armpits, shaving my pussy should be a fucking choice. 
like that's it that's all i think i said it all oh and another thing i want the same damn equality as a man when i go swimming sometimes i hate swimming tops want my nipples are pierced so i don't like those things i hate those things because they contain a lot of fucking water and it'd be so much easier just to swim without a top on like everybody else but i don't want to be oogled and stuff and i don't want to go to jail but i think that's bullshit that my husband can swim without a shirt oh and then he could also like have the hairiest fucking armpits that he want like you can motherfucking do cornrows in his armpits but when nobody say shit wouldn't nobody want to put a rust rose session on him why because he's got a dick that's why all right i'm done i'm done before i like lose my mind point of the rant get over it. it's 2016 we got more shit to worry about than a female's body here bye